All right, hit me. Mm, nice. <laughs> yeah. And we are into another new hour. Insensitivity training for a politically correct world. It's a pre-Friday. It's a Thursday morning. July the 25th, 2024. I'm Woody. That's Greg Gorey. Yeah. Menace is here. What is up? Woody. Seabass is here. We out here. Just, uh, had some bagels delivered. That's nice. Oh, bad. Yeah. He has an idea for a new business, by the way. Yeah, There's so, Sammy. Morning. Morning, Sammy. <laughs> I have an idea for you know Uber Eats, DoorDash, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Yeah. I'm gonna start my uh, competing delivery service, but my uh -huh. advantage will be I won't hire complete effing R words. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's wow. what the, and, and when he says R, he means with like a hard R because, <laughs> because he was is, talking about like this one so he we just have, had. The one I, I deliver it. <laughs> I know our. our I mean, we have a side street, basically, and I put I drop the pin right outside the loading dock, and I say, yeah. "I'll meet you downstairs by yeah. the loading dock." I mean, you really can't miss it. It's you can't one, miss one it. block. And by long. the way, it's not like there's 15 other businesses down there. There's nothing yeah. down yeah, there. There's no, no one there. At this and time of the day, especially empty. this street that he's talking about. This is the quiet street. It's nothing. Surrounded there's by other very busy streets, this is a here. very quiet no street. No foot traffic. It's like a legal alley. So let's yeah. say you're you got you got to you see the guy and you got your pin, and you got your address, and you mm. see one person, Seabass, standing on the street. Yeah, and you have instructions. And he's holding his phone and he's waving at. You. Do you <laughs> perhaps think this might be the guy that you're delivering to? Or yeah. do you drive by and go to the end of the block and turn around? <laughs> hmm. I say hmm. stop and give it to the guy that's waving hey, at is me. Hey, is this Sebastian? Is that I, yeah. I say just cancel the no, order. No, yeah. You couldn't find the guy. <laughs> and by the way, not drive to the end of the block, turn, like not say, oh, whoops, I missed him. Drive, park for a second, oh. and oh. dick around for a while, oh. and then eventually drive back to the guy who's been waving at you the whole time. <laughs> and this is not the first time something like this has happened. No. He, then again, again, no offense. I know a lot of you are delivery guys are listening. I was a delivery person before, uh, mm -hmm. way back when. Just don't be an idiot. Don't yeah. be stupid. Yeah. We're not talking about you. We're talking about other. Yeah, we're people. talking about the other idiots, not you. <laughs> idiots. <laughs> yeah. Million dollar idea. That's a yeah. good idea. Yeah. Oh, yeah. this happens all the time too. Where like I'll order something and it'll say, you know, no substitutions. Blah 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 blah. Mm, yeah. Let's say for instance, it's a sprite, and I order six sprites, mm. and I get a sprite, and then. You know, squirt and four Fantas and <laughs> seven up, and then there and oh, and, and five of the other items are completely yeah. missing. I'm now I, I'm one of the apps. I won't say which one. They they now flag me because I've reported so many incorrect deliveries. Like oh, we've well, noticed you're having uh, a lot of problems guy. with your yeah. orders. No, I'm not. No, your people are stupid. You're the problem. You're idiots. <laughs> <sighs> yeah. People just don't care about anything. I think I think it's a combination of don't care slash are stupid. Yeah, it's all those things rolled into a nice little snowball of incompetence. Pretty much. Yeah. We're living it. Uh, 877-44-WOODY is the phone number. You can hit us up with a text over to 22987. Uh, we're going to play Guess Who's Gas. Nice. Radio's most immature game. That's happening this hour. Uh, got a couple flatulence-related items here for you. Okay. Starting with, don't believe everything you read, everybody. Seeing it on the internet doesn't necessarily mean that it's real. No, it's truth. Uh, there was a post on the site Snopes. That uh, farting at Disney parks can get you banned for life. Uh, guess what? This is not real. What? But a lot of people <laughs> thought it was real, and they were really upset about it. Here's the uh, here's a little audio from that uh, from that post. Here. Anyone who is caught farting inside a Disney theme park may be kicked out and potentially banned for life. Disney will be using thermal cameras installed. Okay. Uh, all yeah. right. Sure. Uh, oh, sorry. Here, I no. That was that was my bad. I like to ban TikTok voice for life. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Is that a, I know. Is no, that, I think that's a guy. Yeah, I say, is that TikTok voice? TikTok voice was different. No, 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 I don't, mm. I don't mean speak over, like that, that style oh, of delivery. Nice. Oh, yeah, yeah, Oh, my yeah. God, you guys, you won't believe that. Yeah. That, yeah, 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 here we go. Yeah. Anyone who is caught farting inside a Disney theme park may be kicked out and potentially banned for life. Disney will be using thermal cameras installed throughout their parks to track if and when a guest farts. No, if seen farting on one of these cameras, Disney World security will be sent out to find you and detain you. The craziest part <laughs> is this applies to both adults and kids. The good news is bathrooms are safe zones. Disney is doing this to make the guest experience better for others. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Well, this obviously was a joke. Uh, right. But post, but people took it seriously. Correct. Uh, because it was on like you know Mouse yeah. News or whatever site or what. Mm -hmm. So, uh, here's a couple of the comments. Holden says the people in this country are turning into a bunch of friggin' wimps. Yeah. Donnie says f Disney. It's part of effing life. What the f? Especially as you get older. Yeah, you just fart. We were just uh, talking about that. Is Al there a bunch says, of delivery drivers on there? 
Al P says yeah, yeah. Disney is so full of ish. Everyone should just stop going to that effing place. Disney can go f themselves. Let's see how they make money afterwards. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Alejandro says so stupid. You go over to spend our money and then don't appreciate that. I hope they go bankrupt. Don't even go to Disney. Yeah. Alex says Disney needs to get a life. It's part of natural <laughs> life. Yeah, get over it. Do they it. realize later after their comments how <laughs> stupid they are? I, uh, yeah, I yeah, like they, there should be. We should be able to go back because these people are easy to find and just no yeah. internet for two years. Yeah. yeah. Uh, in other guess who's gas news, check out this dog, Greg, okay. who might have set the world record for longest dog fart. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like an older Dugan. He did a baby, baby. baby foot again. Just a baby. And he ripped a very impressive marathoner 18 seconds long. Whoa! Yeah, kind of standing in the doorway of uh, of this woman's kitchen. She uh, happened to catch it on video. <laughs> Listen to this. <laughs> Good boy. Wow. Yeah. Wow. When my dog farts, she. Freaks herself out. She'll it'll you hear a little <laughs> and she jumps up as if she got <laughs> bitten by something. What happened? Yeah. Rot was rot. Yeah. yeah. I, I think the longest one we ever got was the uh, the one from Greg. Oh yeah, I'm proud of that. Yeah. This is uh from August of twenty seventeen. This is Greg's longest. I forget how long it was. Let's time it. Okay. And see how it compares to the uh to the Dugan dude. All right. All right, here we go. <laughs> Wow, it's a wimpy wow. seven point eight oh, seconds. Oh man, I got nothing on that dog. Yeah, that dog just well, destroyed you. Yeah, that was a crying fart. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that's the one that we matched up with the crying from intervention. Oh yeah, <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, the classic. Yeah, I forgot about oh, that. Boing. Yeah, R. I. P. To that guy, he died. Oh, oh hey. yeah. come on, babe. Uh, so we're gonna play Guess Who's Gas. That's coming up next. It's Radio's Most Immature Game. So I have uh, some submissions, some homework submissions from people here in the studio, except for Sammy. She Why says, my quiet. farts don't make noise. They don't. They <laughs> smell, but they don't okay. really make a sound. It's just an mm -hmm. open door. <laughs> so I'm picturing like somebody, you know, you take like a beer bottle and you blow over the top, the opening of it, like, ooh. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> like, I don't know what's going on down there that yours don't make noise. Like, Sometimes do you not pucker down do. there anymore? Like, because like, that's what happens. Like, you know, that's why they call it a balloon knot. Yeah. Like, so when air escapes a balloon, it's like, it, it has to make noise. I mean, well, I mean sometimes, sometimes they do, but when it does, it surprises me. Like, it sneaks mm. up on me because uh, they usually don't. Yeah. You know, and the best have, what, sounding ones are in the shower. I say, she and I can't record when I'm in there. Anyway. An explanation. <laughs> so your options for this particular round will be uh, Woody, Greg, Menace, or Seabass. Right. So right off the bat, you have better Way odds. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If you want to play 877-44-WOODY, call now. 877-44-WOODY. Imagine being able to go through the rest of your day saying how you won a prize on the radio. Yes. Yes. Not only being able to, but yeah. it's mandatory. Well, here we are on the doorstep of radio's most immature game. Oh, it is. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, let's play Guess Who's Guess? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Roof. Is this still your favorite game that we play, Greg? I mean, probably favorite uh, in the top three for the sure. Top three. I mean, I like basically every game. Uh, games are fun. Games are so fun. Yeah. I love Guess Who's Gas. I really yeah. love the DUIQ. This one started. Uh, we were talking about something really dark and serious. Yeah, Whatever the big heavy. news story of the day was, and uh, we're like, "Wow, awkward transition." How do you? How do you move on from this? Got to cleanse the palate. And I remember that I had something in my phone. And I said, "Hey, I'm gonna, I'm gonna play you something. Uh, guess whose gas this is? <laughs> Somebody in this room. It turned out to be mine. It was a, uh, it was a black bean burger fart. Mm. Right. Because I had some black bean burgers that I was addicted to at the time. And man, those things really gassed me up. And what compels you to record it? Uh, cause I knew yeah. that you thought it was funny. Oh, okay, good. Yeah. Man, cause surprise. like, I would, I would send you like, uh, those texts every once in a while. Those like, uh -huh. those, uh, audio message texts. Right. About <laughs> farts. Also for historical Wait. reasons. Yeah. Right? You don't remember that? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. These been like one of our things, babe. For the archives. Yeah. yeah so right. sweet of him. Yeah. I, I know. That's very nice. Yeah. Do I have so the. So thoughtful. Do I have, I think my, I got like the original here somewhere, but anyway. The OG. The OG black bean burger fart. 
So it became this uh, really, I mean, we talk about bottom of the barrel. This is under the barrel, guys. Oh, for sure. Yeah. You take it to the next level, too, because you'll go into a closet to do oh. it. You'll put your butt into a drawer. Yeah, so yeah. Some, I'll mess with the acoustics sometimes. Yeah. See, that's, for quality. Yeah. Usually, it's for me, it's just, oh, God, I got to record this. Or sometimes, if you're like in a really, uh, like a location that provides really great reverb, like a bathroom, yes. a shower, sometimes that's fun. <laughs> I, I've done it before where I've pressed my ass up against like a like a like like the tile of the shower. <laughs> You know, to uh, to capture it that way. And then your wife walks in. Uh, what are you doing? Yeah. I'm working. Uh, I'm just I'm yeah, working. I'm putting it on uh, the glass. I'm paying the bills. I'm doing yeah. show prep. Yeah. yeah. You know this lifestyle that you love so yeah. much? This yeah. This is how we earn it. Yeah, bitch. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Does this not look like work? Yeah. I expect to have dinner ready when I come downstairs. Yeah. If you want yeah. a new purse, you would shut up. Oh, that's my man. Yeah, yeah. bitch. Yeah. 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 <laughs> so ongoing homework. The only person not participating is Sammy because she says that her uh, farts don't make noise. Oh, Whatever. Cool. So... Nice. But they probably go. <sighs> the yeah. options for guess who's gas? Woody, Greg, Menace, or Seabass. All right, so I'll, I'll play you the uh, I'll play you the uh, the sound. I'll play you the gas, uh, and then uh, not that one. No. And then you just have to guess whose gas it is. Eight seven seven forty four Woody. That's eight seven seven forty four Woody. Let's go to Horatio. Good morning, Horatio. How are you guys doing? We're doing great. We're so, playing Guess Who's Gas. Horatio, when you're ready, say, hit me. All right, hit me. <laughs> <laughs> mm, nice. <laughs> nice right. and fast. Yep. Yeah. You probably need to hear that yeah, again. He let's uh, let's give you another shot at it. <laughs> <laughs> I call that one the hey -o. Yeah. It's fast but strong. Yeah, yeah we always juicy. try to name them, too. That's the hey -o. <laughs> hey -o. It's very solid. <laughs> hey -o. Yeah. Hey -o. <laughs> hey -o. All right, so Horatio, guess who's gas? Woody, Greg, Menace, or Seabass? All right, I'm going to have to say Greg. Show me Greg Gory. Oh, no. Oh, sorry, Horatio. Yeah, sorry, Horatio. Appreciate you uh, listening Damn. to the Woody Show. 877-44-Woody. Let's go to Tim. Good morning, Tim. Tim. Good morning. We are playing radio's most immature game. It's guess who's gas. When you're ready, say hit me. Hit me. Hey. -o. <laughs> That's not really a lawnmower fart. Somebody's saying that it's more like a lawnmower. No, no. it's definitely a hey-o. Hey -o. This is maybe yeah. or starting a lawnmower or trying. There's something mechanical there. Yeah. I can yeah, see that. yeah, yeah. All right. So Tim, your options are Woody, Menace, or Sea Bass. Guess who's gas? That's a that's a lift of one sheet. I'm gonna go menace. Show me right. menace. Oh, oh damn. no. Damn. All right. Well, Tim, thank you for the call. Appreciate you listening to The Woody Show. Let's say hi to Neo. Good morning, Neo. Neo. Hey, how's it going? Hi. We're playing Guess Who's Gas, radio's most immature game. When you're ready, say hit me. Hit me. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It almost has an electronic component <laughs> yeah, at the end. Yeah, like you think? A, yeah. Like a... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, like it could be yeah, like, a, like a, in dubstep music. Yeah, yeah. exactly. <laughs> the pre <laughs> <laughs> sample that. Yeah. The, <laughs> the previous caller talked about a cheek lifting. Have you done that before? Where you're laying on your side and then oh, yeah. you, like, you grab of course. your cheek. Or you're sitting in a chair yeah. and you kind of like right. squeak yeah. it. Naturally, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, so uh, yeah. the options for you, Neo... Guess who's gas, Woody or Seabass? Uh, let's go, Woody. Show me Woody. Neo, congratulations. You are a winner on this round of Guess Who's Gas. Excellent. Yeah, it's, uh, that's mine. It's the other day. A lot more protein these days, so nice. they, they begin a little more forceful. <laughs> right. Well, the, the proteins the stink. And oh. the, the vegetables that are I'm saying it's making me more gassy. It's See, making ever me more since gassy. I started eating better, I'm way less gassy. Yeah. All right. So, uh, hey, Neo, hang on one second, man. We'll get all your information. You guys want to play another round? Of course. Wait, what? Neo, thank you. All right, thank you. Uh, well see. done. Uh, let me pick out another one here. Okay. Um, mm. Let's see. All right. Do you want one called uh, The Drag Racer? Oh, that's got to be good. Or Is do you want one called Angry Blast? Hmm. Oh, the choices are too good. Yeah. Aren't they all Angry Blast? Yeah. I would say Drag Racer. Racer. Yeah. Drag Racer? Yeah. All right. Hold on. <laughs> Let me go to my library of toots. We've had 
<laughs> zippers before. This is like that national seed or that that World Seed Bank yeah, in yeah, Iceland yeah. where they're yeah. all stored in a big vault yeah. uh-huh. right. under yeah, a glacier. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, and you got to like you know they bring out like a tray full of all your options and you just kind of point to the one that Ooh, you want, like a dessert mm-hmm. cart, like a dessert yeah. cart. Yeah, or when you get your lobster. All right, guess who's gas? Let's go and uh, grab another contestant here. Everybody's back on the table. Okay. All right, uh, Leslie. Good morning. Good morning. Good hey, morning. Leslie. All right, so we're playing Guess Who's Gas. This one uh, I've dubbed the Drag Racer. When you're ready for it, say, hit me. All right. Hit me. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> what happened? Right. Yeah, here we go. One more time. <laughs> oh. It's a little oh. messy. But yeah. I didn't hear it the first time. Yeah. I heard it then, though, for sure. Probably all the laughs. Um. Yeah. <laughs> the drag racer. All right, your options, Woody, Greg, Menace, or yeah. Seabass, guess who's guess? <laughs> I'm going to guess Menace. Show me Menace. Oh, oh no. Darn it. Oh. Yeah. Sorry about that, Leslie. Yeah, Appreciate sorry, you listening. Leslie. Have yourself a great day. Let's go to B-Rad. Good morning, Brad. 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 Hey, how's it going, guys? What's Good. up, man? All right, so guess who's gas? When you're ready, say hit me. Hit me. <laughs> <laughs> the ending of that made a Jackson Pollock painting. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. That's like when the little bit of water comes out of the uh, the ketchup bottle, you know? Yes. yes. That's yes. Exactly. Oh, yeah. God. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Should have shaken that first. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so Brad. Uh, so Menace was the guest in the last one, right? Uh, yeah. All right, so Woody, Greg, or Seabass, guess who's gas? Let's go Greg Gory. Show me. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm what? Greg Gory. This no. This might be my part. Yeah, not Greg. <laughs> no. Yeah. Negative. Not Greg. No, not dog. Greg. Thank no. you, Brad. No, Here, dog. Dog. Sorry about that, Let's homie. go to uh, <laughs> Travis. Good morning, Travis. <laughs> Good morning. How you guys morning. doing? We're doing great. I mean, it's radio's most immature game. We're playing Guess Who's Gas. When you're ready, say hit me. Hit me. <laughs> we call it the drag racer. Your options are Woody or Seabass. Guess who's gas. I know. Uh, I can spell Woody through that. All right, Woody. your guess is Woody. Show me Woody. Oh, oh no. Oh. Oh. See, that should have been an easy putt. Yeah, I know. Well, just listen to the first one, which was Woody. Yeah. Uh-huh. Find the timbre. Well, but again, the I'm tone. a guy who likes to switch it up. I'll clench yeah. butt cheeks. I'll... See, Sammy, maybe that's what you need to do. Yeah. When you feel one brewing, like, like squeeze really your... Clench. Yeah. yeah, clench a little bit. Or, or like use your hands to push your butt cheeks together. All right, something I'll like work that. on it. I'll Sit do better, you guys. I'm sorry. Yeah. Sit on a wet chair. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Well, this is going to be very easy for Joey. Good morning, Joey. Joey. Good morning, Woody Show. Good morning. We're going to just make this one, uh, you know, just for, just for the, the whole process of it, the procedure yeah. of it. Uh, when you're ready, say, hit me. Hit me. All right, Joey, <laughs> guess who's gas? Definitely Seabass. Definitely Seabass. Yes. Congratulations. Yeah, you did. You are a winner here on Guess Who's Gas. Choo, choo, choo. Hey, Joey. Awesome, thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. All right, Joey, hang on one second. We'll get all of your information. You guys, that's how you play. Oh, Guess good. who's gas. <laughs> yeah, somebody said that uh, that one I just played, uh, that was mine, mm-hmm. definitely sounds kind of like Nine Inch Nails, it's totally closer like... mechanical yes. kind of thing. Yeah, there's, there's a lot of things going on there. It's very uh, nuanced. <laughs> it's, got it, it, it's got depth. Uh, it's got depth. Yeah, the drag racer is pretty good. Do you remember anything about that, Sea Bass? Well, you can tell no? it's high and tight. You know, yeah. it's, <laughs> it's it's firm but it, uh, yeah. efficient, yeah. forceful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But not all loose. <laughs> all right, yeah. that one. Yeah. <laughs> remember the one we called the uh, fresh roadkill? <laughs> yeah. Uh, Oof. Uh, let's see, black bean burger. I know that's the. There's literally hundreds in this fall. I know there is. Oh yeah, here's yeah. This this is the OG. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, it's a yeah. piece of history. It's so yeah. cool. It's like, it's, yeah. it's like it was pressed in wax. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Should be yeah. Smithsonian. Right. Or squeezing into a pair of leather yeah. pants. Yeah. yeah. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> Nobody show. I uh, wanted to mention this because I know it's going to get a reaction immediately from Greg. Oh. I uh, was chatting with our friend Gina Grad. Yes. 
And I said, hey, what are you doing? She says, I'm uh, unsubscribing to all these emails that I get from promoters okay. and from like all the all the uh, the sales emails the, that you yeah. get, the soliciting emails, the pitches and whatnot. Yeah, and you click on, you know, you care to unsubscribe? Click yeah. here. And she's doing. It. She was like so satisfied with the process. Oh, I love yeah, that. It's the best. It's so I much fun. I would be satisfied with the process <laughs> if it actually unsubscribed you, right? Yeah. Yeah, I uh -huh. have unsubscribed from so much crap. And you're right. Most yeah. recently, it was a winery that I had gone to, <laughs> and I had to. I wanted to enter to win a magnum uh -huh. of cab. So I said, "Yeah, I'll, I'll do that." And the only way they would notify you was through email, and I knew they just wanted my email. Sure, and that's fine. But I had to win this thing, which I didn't <laughs> win. And then I got email, 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 and I thought, "All right, I'll, I'll check out a few of them. Maybe they're mm -hmm. offering deals." After 20 emails, okay, unsubscribe. And then a yeah. week later, more emails from the winery. Yeah. And this happens yeah, with they, them. They trick you. You got to really read it uh, when you're unsubscribing because they're actually asking, are you sure you want to? Oh. Like, for sure, for sure. I'm 100%. And then sometimes <laughs> it's still clicked. And I, I or you have to give them different options. Like, oh, I yeah. just want emails from this particular the, yeah. you know, right. Right. sales, Usually, not just uh -huh. general. Usually there's yeah. some sort of uh -huh. like pop-up thing that says, do you want at least yeah. to be told about specials? No, no. unsubscribe <laughs> from all of it. You know, I don't want it, any of that. Yeah. And news sites do that too. But I'm with you, it doesn't really work. It's like that, uh, we were talking about the uh, the closed doors elevator button. Yeah. Like, it doesn't really uh -huh. work. No, it doesn't do so, anything. Don't you yeah. love it when you click on it, it says, uh, give us three yeah. to five business days. To <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. As if there's somebody yeah. manually yeah. going manually through there that has to reconcile it. Liars. I'm going through this with the... The baseball team, the Oakland A's, because it's a long story, but my friends want to go to the stadium just to see how crappy it is. Oh, it's not crappy. because they're not not because they're fans of the team. They just want to see it how crappy it is. Aren't tickets like free? Right. You just pretty go? much, pretty oh, much. Yeah, we so I said, so I said, you have to call in a favor for <laughs> yeah. that. So I said, okay, I'll I'll handle getting the tickets for again, like super cheap, like five bucks, and. Now I'm on the email list and I cannot get yeah. off of it. I yep. have tried in the email every single yep. day. I do not care. <laughs> I think they put that up there because legally they're supposed to have it up there, but it doesn't really do anything. It doesn't yeah. do anything. Yeah. It's, and it's, I get mm -hmm. it for stuff yeah. that I never even asked for. Well, I'm yeah. glad Gina had such a great time right. wasting her time. Yeah. yeah. Let her know. That have you ever done that, it was Menace? All for nothing. You know, uh, Apple will let you disguise your email. No. Have you seen that? Like, with, oh, I do you use Apple Pay? Uh, I do. I okay, do. I love that's Apple who, Pay. That's usually where I see it. Um, mm -hmm. Like I'll go to Apple Pay something and it'll ask, would you like to use like a disguised email? And it, yeah. it'll forward stuff to your email, but I think it's a way so that they don't oh, get your yeah. actual. Actually, I have seen that. Yeah. You don't, they don't get yeah, your yeah. actual it's like email a, address. Just like a bunch of numbers and then an email address. Yeah, right. I have. But uh, yeah, I love Apple Pay. I didn't know Pay. if that cut down on anything. No. There are a few different companies that provide that mm -hmm. service—a temporary email just for yeah. Apple does buying that. Something yeah. Or I mean, I just think that unsubscribe button—it's it's just as effective as the no call list. It, totally. Yeah. yeah. True. Totally. It, yeah. But if you but tell I'm on them, the, but I'm on the no call list. If you tell them yeah. you're on the no call yeah. list, you'll get a hundred thousand dollars per call.